Okay, you have a problem. You're like me. You keep cutting down trees and not replanting the acorns in tree area, and then after a couple hours, you open up the map and there are no trees left in your world. You could just grab your acorns and start planting them around the place, or you could do what I did, make a semi-automatic tree farm, which is exactly what I'll be covering how to do in this video. Now, before you watch this video, you could obviously just use the axe of regrowth and it will automatically plant acorns for you as you cut down the trees. Personally, I prefer using a farm like this because it's easy to make and I can easily get thousands of wood with one click. You might get a little skeptical right now because it's hard to think of a way to possibly automate a tree farm in Terraria. There's no pistons and bone meal like Minecraft, so how could we possibly do it? Well, the answer is quite simple actually. Lava. How? I'll get into that in just a minute. Before we start, remember to leave a like if you enjoyed this video and want more like it. We're almost at 10,000 subscribers and I want to thank every single one of my supporters for helping me get this far on my YouTube journey. I really enjoy making these videos for you guys and I hope I will continue to be able to for a long time. Okay now no more waiting, let's get straight into it. For this tree farm in Terraria, you're gonna need all the following. Some dirt blocks, some wood and platforms, torches, one lava bucket, one actuator, acorns, either grass seeds or the staff of regrowth, and some wiring equipment like the wrench, wire cutters, wire, and a switcher lever. After you've collected everything, you'll have to choose a place to build your tree farm. I usually like to do it in the sky to save some space on the ground. You can also choose to build a farm in any bomb you want if you want that bomb's wood instead of regular wood. So for example, you could build a farm in the beach for palm trees or in an evil biome for shade or ebon wood. After you've chosen a space, start by placing down a row of dirt blocks as such. I'm using a row of about 60 dirt blocks. At the end of the row, build down two dirt blocks and start building back across to the start making sure to leave a space of one block in between like this. Once you reach back to the start of the row, build a little dip like this. Now go back to the end of your row and place a dirt block in the second to last empty space like this. Place an actuator on this dirt block and put lava from the lava bucket in the empty one block hole to the side of it. At the start of the dirt row, put a few platforms down and put your switch or lever and wire it up to an actuator like this. Once this is all done, plant your acorns and your tree farm is ready. How? It's very simple. When you click the lever, the lava will flow along the empty space space and cut down all the trees super quick. This works because lava destroys any grass that's near it, and if there's no grass, the tree will fall too. After the lava flows all the way and reaches the end, collect it from the start in a bucket and put it back at the end to reset the farm. Wait for the grass to grow back or use the staff of regrowth to put grass on the dirt blocks again and then plant the acorns. I only made one small row for this farm, although you can obviously duplicate this farm many times and make much longer rows for more wood per harvest. I know most people are satisfied enough with the axe of regrowth, although I enjoy Enjoy playing around in Terraria and after creating this tree farm I had to show it to you guys. Whether or not you decide to make it I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to leave a like if you want to see more quick guides and content like this. Have a beautiful day until next time peace.